Today we are making two ingredient cheese. You can use fresh raw milk, you can use whole milk, you can skim it off and have skim milk, you can use store-bought milk for this. You're going to want to heat it up pretty warm, you can see the steam off of this. Make sure you stir it while you're heating it so it doesn't burn on the bottom. And then you're going to pour in a little bit of white vinegar, stir that around, and you're just going to keep doing that until it separates all the way. You'll see some of the cheese starting to form and stick to whatever you use to stir it with. But like I said, keep adding more vinegar until it separates all the way. Once your cheese fully separates from the whey, it'll be time to strain it out. One thing to know about this cheese is depending on the temperature your milk was, you will get different textures. It will, however, all taste the same. You can get a fine crumb cheese, a medium or a large crumb cheese, or even a very sticky cheese like mozzarella. All you will need to do once you get it strained is mix in your salt. If you do have a colander you're using, you will need to use cheesecloth if it's the smaller crumb or it will all go out the holes of the larger colanders.